For our next meal, we're gonna make the bucket pita. What we're gonna be needing is skinless, boneless chicken breast, fresh spinach, pita bread, goat cheese, and pesto sauce. I made the pesto sauce, but next time I'll show you how to make it. First, what we're gonna be starting is start to slice the chicken. You're gonna make it as cubes. You want the chicken to be cut and sliced so you can be able to fit them in the pita bread. And now that we've finished cutting the chicken, we're gonna season it a bit with salt and pepper. And I like my sandwiches to be full of flavor. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna use half of the pesto sauce for cooking and then the other half to put it in the sandwich. So what I will do is, grab a teaspoon of pesto sauce, just spread it very easily top of the chicken. There we go. And now I'm just gonna cook the chicken. So on a stove top, medium to high heat, have oil ready, and then cook the chicken. Now that we have our chicken ready, we're gonna start doing our pocket pita. It's plate. So you cut the pita in half, as you can see, the reason I call it pocket, because it's like a pocket sandwich. And then you're gonna put the pesto inside the sandwich, spread the pesto on the pita, and be generous. Have it spread everywhere, so every single bite in your mouth has a piece of the pesto, of the chicken, of the spinach, the goat cheese. So after you put the pesto, put the spinach inside. Then you put the chunks of chicken that's already nice, brown, it smells so good. And then you put the goat cheese on the top. There you go. Oh, I cannot wait till I sit in front of my sofa and enjoy my lovely dinner to myself. Pocket pita. Nice stuff with the pesto, the chicken. Go cheese and spinach.